Hello everyone, Muswan Jr. here. We're back in Crusader Kings 2. Our uh, Let's learn how to play campaign, basically. We are... King Cedric the Cruel of Essex. We've expanded to one more county. We are... Kind of in a tight spot. We want to get big enough where we can counter... King Offa, I want to be able to declare a uh, free tributary war, but <clears throat> his personal levy is still much big, much bigger than ours. And they have expanded, I believe, into the county of Surrey and the county of Suffolk, Sussex. Yeah. We could start focusing on East Anglia. He's also a tributary of King Offa. The border dispute. What is his levy? 646. Yeah, he would be a cakewalk. If only we could do a declare war for vassalization, that would be pretty, pretty good. We can't move our Chancellor until February of next year. We are currently plotting to kill this guy. This guy, right? Heir to the petty kingdom of Huesa. Oh yeah, right here. We are married to her. So we definitely want to kill her siblings, her two younger brothers. Right by we, my son is, is betrothed to her. Anything we do to pick up extra counties easily would be just good, I think. We're just gonna let it roll on speed four, I think. Yeah, we're on speed four. Press de jour ducal claims. I wonder what happens if we declare this. We can't. Because we would have to declare directly on King Offa. Right? Even then, we, the only war we declare on Offa is the Free Tributary. Yeah, we're not going to do that. I've had my eye on a feisty young scullery maid with huge intellect for some time now. Though she skillfully dodges the intentions of everybody, and every boy and graybeard at court, I have her blushing furiously whenever I gaze into her eyes. Seduced and wrapped around my finger, this sharp lass could be very useful. Make her a lady and keep her as my mistress. It's maid servant lover until 819. Well, that's 20 years. Uh, plus one intrigue, plot discovery chance 10%. A common wench, I can do better. I mean, what a spy she'll make. Obviously. We have no current regent. Uh,. Go ahead and make you the regent. Thinking new ways to make Sarah like me more is hurting my brain. And yet, for as much as I hate exhausting myself, something needs to be done if I ever wish her to be my friend. Ah, yes, my chancellor will write her something. Why were... who is she? 
She was not too impressed. Who is she? Why were we fo- I don't remember why we were focused on her. It's been some time since I played. King Uthred the Chaste. I don't remember why we were so focused on her. We're gonna, we're not gonna worry about that. I'm sure it had something to do with the. It has something to do with the plot. She's related to someone. Oh, I remember now. This is her. I gave the priest such a scolding today when he dared ask me, his rightful legion lord, for a donation. Isn't he living on my sufferance? And would I allowed him to collect money himself for his parish? Ooh. She overheard the scolding. After the scolding of the priest, I left... I... After my scolding of the priest, I left fuming with anger, was ready to slap whoever it was that touched my arm to stop me. In front of me stood Queen Augusta, who told me that the priest certainly deserved the scolding given. The scolding given all I had done for him and the church. Ah, yes, my wife. She, she is so understanding. Okay, um... Oh, I remember. She was just someone who was like on the bubble, and like that 15% plot power is something that we could use. <clears throat> he does like me. She likes me more than she likes the target. She has some moral qualms. Elusive Shadow. <laughs> Being such an industrious ruler, I have not un I have not gone unnoticed by the population of Essex. By paying the county elders a personal visit, they would surely be inspired, and the peasants would feel particularly appreciated. A small donation would also go a long way, of course. Uh, six gold for twenty-five prestige. Inspired peasants. Or build time. Prosperity increased. Yeah, we'll do that. That's fine. Gotta give back to the local populace. Yeah, I really... I really need to find some ways to do that. Ooh. Uh, yeah, no, we want the bonus plot power. Absolutely, we want plot power. The most excellent King Cedric, your wisdom and mercy are legendary. We request that you honor your obligation to answer this call to arms against Monarch the Mercy and Revolt. Oh. Sure. You will accept. Get a steward. I guess we'll go with you, Mayor of London. I don't think he thinks we're actually gonna- I don't know if- I hope the AI knows we're not actually going to participate in that little uprising. Anything that makes him weaker is- is okay with me. Oh good, we're at the plot power we need. That, uh, that will hopefully start to fire. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh, we can move our um, our chancellor. I do wish we had a better one. The six point. My son died. This is not good. Wife, we need to have a baby. Cancel this ambition. We're going to groom an heir. Conscientious, indolent. Just can't get over the fact that she's hunchback and club footed. Like, we brought in um, Augusta because. She was. Uh, we'll just go with uh, that. That's where. She's not, or we're not really going to be able to use her for much of anything. I really hope she doesn't actually become our ruler. We took the seduction, air, yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Oh. Oh, the pox. We have a hospital. Why is this? Why is this beginning a thing? Camp fever. Epidemic typhus. Great. King Cedric, blessings upon you and your house. We propose that Prince Odilio of Bavaria and Mildred, Cedric's daughter, should be betrothed. He is not the heir, but he could be the heir. It is not a matrilineal marriage. Will they do one? Oh no. He is not interested. It's too high in the line of succession. Yeah, okay. I'm not worried about that. Oh no. Right, we have a fever. Very well. Seek treatment for illness. Sure. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew that. Okay. I have contracted camp fever. Negative 20% fertility. Wait. Okay, so we lose fever, rash, headache. We gain this. Okay, that's a little bit, it's, it's, eh. Affable has come to see you and offers treatment for your illness. He explains that there are several different types of treatment he can offer. We're gonna try We're gonna go, uh, we're just gonna roll the dice. Let's try something new. Successful experimental treatment. Plus three martial, plus three intrigue, plus three diplomacy, plus three... <laughs> that's insane! Oh, that's dope! Oh, man. Sometimes it's good to be the king. I guess. Like, that's just... That's just pure luck. The Kingdom of Pickland. He is no one of importance. Right? Oh, wait, no. He's right there. We'll decline. Will he do a... He would do matrilineal. Sure. Why not? Oh, all of a sudden we're at 53 plot power. Why? Oh, dude. Yep, we're gonna burn the apostate. And we need a new marshal. It'll be you. You will train troops. Oh, research tech. No, we want to improve religious relations. And actually... Religious relations here. Do that. Ha <laughs> ha Yes. Wait, we don't even... This plot is useless now because... Oh man. Alright, we have a claim. Pl 
completely useless. That's really upsetting. Um, scheme. In see Kate. Where are you? Oh, you're all the way up there. You don't scare me. We're going to raise levees. We'll wrap up this little war and then uh, we'll take a break. My troops are performing with excellence, and my chest is swelling with pride as we keep pressing forward. I turn back to answer the call of a soldier nearby, and when suddenly there is a sharp pain in my leg, gritting my teeth, I hear an enemy shouting, Stay down, you maimed blasphemer. I can duel him because I have the brave trait. I can accept any inj injury if it protects Essex. Um, I don't feel like rolling the dice right now on a duel, so we will opt to not duel. We captured some people. Good. Someone died, and I missed the pop-up. Kinda sucks. Victory. That siege. Oh, he, we even we have enough war score. It's fine. All right. Great. Why is that? No. Oh. For whatever reason, that petty kingdom or the bishopric belongs to Mercia. Intriguing. Okay, anywho, we will take a break here, and when we come back, we will uh, just keep keep on keeping on. Uh, if you're enjoying the series, hit that like button. If you're enjoying the channel, please subscribe. Uh, feel free to leave comments. Again, I'm still relatively new to Crusader Kings 2 as a as a player, so any uh, any suggestions or hints or tricks you have or would be helpful. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye bye.